Welcome back. Well, look, new at five, who doesn't love getting their hair done? For some, getting your hair chemically straightened is a part of the process, but studies show it can lead to health complications like cancer. And now the FDA working to ban that ingredient they say is causing it. Our Janae Reese on your corner tonight. She spoke with local hairstylists and explains how some of your favorite hair products might change a little bit sooner than you think. Known to some as the creamy crack, a relaxer, or a Brazilian blowout. Ways to get your hair straight and skills cosmetologists like Nikisha Green had to learn. I started using the Brazilian blowout. It was popular. Holly Berry had it. It was the Hollywood thing. Green sat down with WJZ. She says she's been a cosmetologist for more than two decades and remembers the first time she learned about chemical hair straighteners. We all had to do it. We all had to learn it. You know, um, everyone wanted it. She remembers applying a product containing the ingredient formaldehyde. You know, blow dry the hair. You then flat on the product, and that is what releases the product into the air. And so I began to feel nauseous, like extremely nauseous. She knew something wasn't right. And I'm thinking, if this is something I have to wear a mask to apply, what is it doing to the person that I'm using it on? Turns out, she wasn't alone. The Food and Drug Administration intends to ban the use of formaldehyde, a key ingredient in many hair straightening products. Moving forward, I would not. I would not offer a service that I cannot do. The proposed ruling was initially scheduled in early 2024, but has since been postponed to July. The proposal comes after research released in 2022 by the American Cancer Society. It linked the chemical to cancer and other health related issues. I just think the effects, you know, the overall effects of formaldehyde. It can irritate the throat, nose, eyes, and skin. But some stylists say they don't see the need for the ban because most of their clients don't use chemicals in their hair, anyways. I wanted to, people to know that you can get your hair straight. And it'd be bone straight without having to get a relaxer. Ebony Mitchell says only about 2% of her clients have relaxed hair. But I definitely don't recommend ever to do any type of chemical service on your hair yourself. The FDA says consumers should ask their hairstylists about product ingredients and can look out for these words on labels. So I recommend you going to a professional and allowing them to do the product and the service and suggesting what you use at home that's safe for you. Reporting in Timonium, I'm Janae Reese for WGZ. The good news about this is that we know now. Exactly. You know, Doing stories you know. like this, bringing it to the forefront, it's important. Yes, they need to know.